What's up guys, I'm in this one I will show you how to create a um, simple null like the one you see in playing here. So yeah, if you want to learn, keep watching also um, hit the subscribe button and like this video. Let's go. So um, basically what you see in here is already a um, video that has been edited in CapCut, the velocity and then I just imported it here in a light motion. And you see in these bitmarks here, those are the original bitmarks where a beat drops and where the velocity takes place. So what I usually like to do is between all those bitmarks, I add another bitmark. Now those bitmarks that I'm just adding right now are for the null reference. I will use this to um, create the null. So I'll just go ahead and add um, bitmarks like so. And then um, group and mask the, I mean sorry, group the, group the null parent them and then on that bitmark that i just added i'll go ahead and tap null there add a keyframe and then that's the original bitmark so i will skip it and go to the next bitmark that i just added so like so and then after that there is all it's time to create the null so you can i just go ahead and do like this so usually you will just play around with this um effects not really effects but these movements here so you go from there you skip another bitmark um, let's just say we move it down like this and then i'm change the angle to like so and then change the angle back again zoom it back again like so skip another one and then maybe zoom in or move it down like so zoom in again skip another one move it back again like so zoom it in properly like so and then um add you know some more of this angle so that's what i usually like to do when null and that's the simple step i use to create the null um video that you just watched earlier so once you're done with all of these once you're done with all of the um add in the keyframes you go ahead and add the graph now for a graph i usually like to use this one here but you can um use different graphs you can also make it something like this but i usually like to use the first one which is like something like that so yeah once you're done with that you just add graph to all the keyframes so it will um they will all match and then also you come back here and then paste graph to all the keyframes. And yeah, that's how you can create the those null videos. Now this is just a simple one. You can um, do advanced ones like adding the shake and all those other stuff where you will create an output. This is basically how to create the null movement. Anyways, if you like this video, thanks for watching and um, see you in the next one. Cheers and bye.